Your Range Rover Evoque is equipped with an advanced park assist feature, allowing you to parallel park in spaces only 20% longer than the vehicle. In this video, we'll show you critical steps in utilising this system to its optimum. The system also aids with exiting spaces when parallel parked. Here's how to activate Park Assist. Always drive carefully, observing and applying all safety measures. Park Assist will aid you with the parking manoeuvre, but it may not detect small objects such as children or animals. When you see a parking space, drive towards it, going no faster than 11 miles per hour. Press the Park Assist button on the touchscreen surround. The LED indicator in the button will illuminate. The system consists of three options, parallel parking, perpendicular parking and parking exit. Press repeatedly until the desired option is selected. Here's how to parallel park using Park Assist. The system automatically searches for a space on the passenger's side. If the space is on the driver's side, signal a turn in that direction. The Park Assist sensors search for a space that is large enough. When an appropriate space is found, a confirmation graphic displays in the message centre, accompanied by a tone. Drive past the space slowly until the system instructs you to stop. Select reverse gear and then release the wheel. Reverse with care, allowing the Park Assist system to take control of the steering. Observe the space and apply the brake pedal if necessary. A message appears letting you know when to stop and select a forward gear. You may need to drive forwards and reverse several times. This will depend on the size of the space and the position of the vehicle. When the system detects that the vehicle is satisfactorily parked, a message instructing you to stop displays. The system then lets you know when Park Assist has finished. Here's how to perpendicular park using Park Assist. When you see a space at a 90 degree angle to the vehicle, drive towards it, going no faster than 11 miles per hour. Then press the Park Assist button repeatedly until Perpendicular Park is selected. The system will then automatically search for a space on the passenger's side. If the space is on the driver's side, signal a turn in that direction. The Park Assist sensors then search for a space wide enough to fit into. When an appropriate space is found, a confirmation graphic displays in the message centre. It's accompanied by a tone. Drive past slowly until the system instructs you to stop. Select Reverse and release the wheel. Then reverse with care, allowing the system to control the steering. Observe the space and apply the brake pedal if necessary. A message will then appear letting you know when to stop. You may need to drive forwards and reverse several times. This will depend on the size of the space and the position of the vehicle. When the system detects that the vehicle is satisfactorily parked, Park Assist instructs you to stop. The system then lets you know when Park Assist has finished. How to exit a space when parallel parked. Press the Park Assist button until Parking Exit is selected. The system will then instruct you to release the wheel while it measures the area around the vehicle. Once the system detects there is enough space to exit, a confirmation message displays and a tone will sound. Select Reverse and await the next instruction. Then reverse with care, allowing the system to take control of the steering. Observe the surrounding area and apply the brake pedal if necessary. A message then appears letting you know when to stop. You may need to drive forwards and reverse several times. This will depend on the size of the space and the position of the vehicle. When the manoeuvre is complete, a message displays informing you to stop and take the wheel. When Park Assist has finished, a message will display in the message centre. For more information on your Range Rover Evoque, please refer to your owner's manual, the LandRoverUSA.com website, or your local retailer.